In London, there is acted out again the dramatic tableau that symbolizes Britain's successful fusion of all the trappings and splendor of an ancient monarchy with a democratic government. The opening of Parliament by the Queen. Elizabeth, accompanied by the Duke of Edinburgh, enters the venerable Hall of Parliament, where she will open the new session of the 300th Parliament in a ceremony rich in color and tradition, but never before filmed or seen by the public. First to the House of Lords, preceded by Field Marshal Viscount Montgomery, who bears the sword of state. The Queen wears the ruby-studded imperial crown and the robe of Parliament, a radiant figure. Then finally to the chamber, where scarlet-robed peers and formerly attired members of Commons in joint session hear the throne speech of the Queen. Today, for the first time, this ceremony is being watched, not only by those who are present in this chamber, but by many millions of my subjects. Peoples in other lands will also be able to witness this renewal of the life of Parliament. Outwardly, they will see the pageantry and the symbols of authority and state. But in their hearts, they will surely respond to the spirit of hope and purpose which inspires our parliamentary tradition.